In this video, we'll write the Lewis structure for XeF5+. Plus. This is the xenon pentafluoride ion, cation. So to draw the Lewis structure, we'll put the least electronegative element in the center. That's going to be the xenon. And then we'll put five fluorine atoms on the outside. Xenon's in group 18, sometimes called 8A. It has eight valence electrons. Fluorine, group 17, sometimes called 7A. That has seven. We have five of those. And then this positive up here, that means we need to subtract one. So we end up with 42 total valence electrons for the XeF5 Lewis structure. So we have our fluorines on the outside. Let's put electrons between atoms. This will form the chemical bonds. So we've used 10 valence electrons. Xenon, it can have an expanded octet, so that's okay. Often you'll see single lines drawn here to show the bonds. We'll just leave them as pairs of electrons though. Now we complete the octet on each fluorine atom. So right now, each fluorine atom it has eight valence electrons, it has an octet, so that's good. That central xenon, it has 10, that's okay, because it can have an expanded octet. But we've only used 40 valence electrons. So we're going to take those last two valence electrons, and we're going to put it right here on the xenon. When we do that, it has 12 valence electrons, but again, it can have an expanded octet. So we've used all 42, each fluorine, it has an octet, the central xenon, it has 12 valence electrons, but that's okay. So this is the Lewis structure for XeF5+. And this is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.